babes welcome back to my channel let's just get right into it let's not waste any time i will let y'all know the details of this style as soon as we're done <laughs> So, as you can see from the title, it, this is Lap Petals with no rubber bands, no pins, no nothing. All you need is your hair um, or your fingers and you need also one um, hair pin if it's a little difficult for you so you can help you. Okay, so um, I pretty much did most of them. So, let's just um, get through this and I'll show you um, how I'm doing it. Okay, so first thing you do is you just grab a lock. You use the hairpin, this is the hairpin that I use to interlock my dreads. This is the same process I use to interlock my dreads, only I'm not gonna go through with the full interlock, I'm just gonna, you know, pull it under the lock. So what you do is you take the loop of the hairpin, the loop of the hairpin, and um, you tuck it right underneath the lock itself. You wanna have um, some new growth um, to help with it, to aid with this style. If you have no new, new growth, it's gonna be hard to do this style. Okay, so you're gonna place the loop of the hairpin underneath your new growth. Then you're gonna take the tip of the lock and you're gonna place it through the loop of the hairpin and pull it underneath your new growth. You're not gonna go all the way, you're just gonna go some, like so. And then you're just gonna leave it, just like that. Simple as that, right? So I got five more to do really quickly here. What this style is, is basically kind of like a bob. It's just how mine turned out. Um, I slept on my locks last night. Um, I did wrap them. So the back of the locks are just a little bit flattened um, as opposed to kind of raised like these um, ones on the top are doing, which I do like because it gives it some type of, it gives it a, a shape, you know, it's giving it some shape. So what I'm doing is putting most of the curls over here on this side. And it's just going to give me this like uh, kind of appearance like I got my locks curled almost. It's like it's like when you got your hair really short. You know, it's really, really short styles. And the ladies curl their hair in layers. It, that's what it reminds me of. Okay, so I got just a couple more here. Then we'll be finished. It's really simple, really easy. I think that's probably, this is the fastest way to do lock pedals. Without the rubber bands, the rubber bands, I'm sure is the pain in the butt. It's got to be because all that looping you have to do around your hair and probably the last loop doesn't loop all the way. So I don't know. I'm just speaking off of what I think might happen if you had like big locks or short locks. Okay, so there we go. Really simple, really easy. Let me do it 360 for you. As you can see, the back, the back curls are a little bit flattened, but that's okay. Um, that's just because I had to wrap my hair last night. Um, but I like it flat like that. I always feel like I don't showcase my locks long enough. Like when you guys are looking at them, trying to see what they look like, I feel like I don't spend enough time showing you guys the back. So that's why I'm spending so much time doing this 360. So that's it. Isn't that really simple, really fast? Honestly, it should take you maybe 30 minutes to do this whole style. Um, I just wanted to make sure I could share it with you guys. That's why I only did part of it and then I finished it this morning for you. Um, so yeah, there, that's it. Uh, lock pedals, no hairpins, no, well, no hairpins to hold them in place, but no rubber bands, no nothing, just your locks and a, a really cute, amazing style. So if you guys have any questions about this style, please feel free to ask in the comment, the comment section below, and I will talk to you guys in my next video. See you later. Bye.